Persepsi yang mendakwa kenaikan gaji menjadi faktor keruntuhan ekonomi sesebuah negara wajar ditukar segera. Ahli jawatan kuasa bantah 1050 Arul Shelvam menegaskan ketika pekerja Malaysia dimomokkan dengan persepsi itu. Pekerja di negara seperti Indonesia, Singapura dan Thailand memiliki gaji jauh lebih tinggi. Ikuti pandangan beliau dalam program Let's Talk with Sherrod Kutin yang bersiaran malam tadi. Because all this while, every time there's a talk about increase in the minimum wage, they come very strongly saying that the economy will collapse, investors will run away. But in fact, statistics will show us that Indonesia, Thailand and Philippines have a higher minimum wage than Malaysia. And you know, and our purchasing power is the lowest in ASEAN. We want them to make it public because you see that um, the technical committee is quite an independent committee. I mean, they have members from the employers as well as the trade unions. And if you look at what they look into, they look into inflation, they look into productivity, they look into unemployment. So, of course, the employers wanted, uh, the workers, the union wanted 1,800. But what we are really disappointed is the government, the cabinet took 1,050 was exactly the amount proposed by the employers' association. The employers' association requested 1,050 starting from January 1st next year, and that's exactly what what the cabinet announced. And I think it's against what the council, you know, the the wage uh, technical committee recommended. And I think that is why we want this technical committee report to be made public. Because if you make that that report public, it will show that you must pay them at least uh, more than thousand hundred and seventy.